It's the most beautiful place I have ever been to. I've traveled a lot. I've never been to a place as serene and magical and captivating as this place. Every hour the color is changing, sometimes it's purple, sometimes green, sometimes blue. So it's, um, yeah, it's very mesmerizing. When I was much younger, something like Mona Sarovar would have been an irritant in my life. <laughs> because uh, I could not leave anything unfigured out in my life. But now I've sort of come to terms, some things you, you don't figure and that's about it. <laughs> Many things in the world are referred to as mysteries. That is in the context of whatever you cannot understand is mysterious to you. Every understanding is a misunderstanding because life can never be understood. It can be lived, it can be experienced, you can reverberate with it, you never ever will understand it. Understanding means you have found a meaning. Meaning is essentially a psychological requirement. Existentially, there is no meaning anywhere. What is the meaning of these pebbles? What is the meaning of the lake? What is the meaning of the mountain? What is the meaning of the vastness of the sky? Tell the ducks about the meaning that you found in Manasarovar. They'll quack, quack, quack. <laughs> so, at least the next few days, Manasura over Kailash, don't assume anything. Oh, Shiva is God Mahadeva. You don't know who the hell he is, let's see. Huh? The only thing that matters now is uh, the life that you are, is it full on or not? That's all. That's all you have to do. Tomorrow the lake will do that to you. 